Hello, welcome to Live with Freedom Forever. In this section, we will see how to download Pentaco. So, before download uh, Pentaco, we need uh, the Java. So, to go download the Java, we can go on this side. You can see. That's, uh, if we go on this side. So we need to go on this side to download the Java and see how we can download. Here we have the country. So you can choose your country or you can go here and then you need to go to the products. And for products you need to go to the Java because we are downloading the Java. And from Java, here we have those products from Java. So we need to know that's uh, which one we will download it. So you will go to if you go to suppose that's a mainly you can choose your country then go to product and then Java and from Java you will see the JRE and this one so we are in the only way you will download this one the JRE so you just press JRE and here you can see the version 8 so download the version So you can see here uh, the Java is downloading. So it's already downloaded. Then now I will install my this Java. So you can run as administrator, and then you need to reinstall. So here there is option that change destination folder. If you want, you can change the destination folder. So I don't recommend to change the destination folder. So I install. So what is uh, telling here? So you can check this those okay then now you can press the install so you can see this is uh, installing the java So okay, it's already. You can see the size. So it detected that uh, I have some backdated version. So I can keep them, or I can just uncheck them, or uninstall but I am not interested to do anything so I will keep them so I just press this uh, not now so it didn't uh, uninstall anything so I have this version installing so I just press next so you can see that uh, 
I successfully install the Java installing so we'll press the close so now if we want to check uh, I have the Java the backdated version is in the program files if I go and check here in Java you can see this is the backdated version I have and the latest version of the Java I have here in this one and in Java you can see in Java this is the version whatever we downloaded no? this so it's installed successfully so now our Java is okay it's installed so now the step two is that uh, download Pentaco. So as I have the Java in two, file, uh, two parts, so it's not a problem for me. Like uh, here, also I have the Java. This is the latest version, and this is the old version Java. So now what I need to do? I need to download the Pentaco. So to download the Pentaco and to go here in this play this site so Java I don't need so Pentaco here you can see there's a this is the version so okay here we came and from here we will search Pentaho. 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 So if you search uh, the Pentaho, you're interested for Windows and this one. <laughs> Mainly this one we need to download this Pentaho. So you just click here and need to download so download so you'll see that uh, within some seconds it will start to download Sometimes this takes a little time. So you can see that uh, this version is downloading. This is the latest version of the Pentaco. So I'll be right back when it will download. Okay, viewers, uh, already we have the file, this one. So the next step is you can download here also because this version is not uh, available now suppose that if you click this if you put here you can see we can see that it's telling that this version is available now so you can download this one directly what we downloaded already so On the, by the both way you can download so already as I have the file this one so what you need to do you need to just uh, copy copy this file and uh, paste it so now what you need to do you need to create a folder about this name so just copy this and here on C drive you create a folder like this name Pen. and copy and paste it so we don't need this
I don't need this also. Okay. So now what we will do, we'll just uh, we did this and now extend the pentaco in the folder. So we will extract this one. Okay, so we extract this one. So now, what we need to do from my computer properties, advanced editing, we need to go here. So So this PC properties and from properties we'll go advanced setting advanced setting and here and here what do we need to do we need to put a variable name home okay so here you will give new in new you will put the home java here is home java put the home java and here you put the without bit it means that you will go we'll go to our without pin so we need to go here in the java so see here program files java jerry without pin so up to here you need to put this here okay I need to put okay and also in the path here in the path you need to put edit and then edit we need to put the JRE the new version so what is the jury version we had This will be with bin, so you need to go to the bin and two to one. We can see that I had a, had this version, so you need to put new and paste. So now we have this version. So almost you can see that both of the versions are same. So in this case we we don't need to do because they put here it's okay so you need to press okay so now what you need to do you need to go to the check the jury in cmd so common prompt what you need to type, you need to type the Java home echo. So to here we type, you can see that uh, my Java is locating this folder. Okay. Jerry is locating this folder, it means. is locating program files program files java so here is locating the updated version so okay and now to run the pentago we need to go We need to go to the 
Pentaco, this one, this one, and from here we can see the spoon, this one. So this one you need to run as administrator. So we can see there's a uh, my version of Pentaco data integration is running. Just still close all of these programs, which is not it. So the Java spy. It takes sometimes a little more time. And here you can see my program is it's okay, it's running and uh, what you need to do, you need to select your server, so now we, if we want to connect to a database we need to create a new job or suppose a job and then you need to create a database connection. So here the database connection you need to give the name, uh, connection name, you need to need uh, your database with whom you want to connect, suppose, just as a, just we are telling here the database name, what is the database name, what is your data warehouse name and uh, here you need to put the user name and password and then you need to check with the test. Thank you for your support.